And it's the calm after the storm. The strong storms, those gusty winds up to 70 miles an hour are gone. Still a lot of cloud cover. Could see a couple light sprinkles just over the next couple of hours. But otherwise, you're going to notice decreasing clouds and much cooler windy conditions tonight. Right now, we are dry over Midtown Atlanta, but still very cloudy. We did pick up a quick burst of rain late this morning across Atlanta. Picked up more than three tenths of an inch of rain. Saw some strong gusty winds as well, although the strongest winds remain south of Atlanta. Right now already chilly, 59 degrees in the city, 58 in Athens, 55 right now in LJ. And compared to this time yesterday, it's like night and day. We're a good 10 to 20 degrees cooler right now compared to this time yesterday. In fact, Atlanta is 15 degrees cooler than this time yesterday. So here's a look at CBS 46 pinpoint radar. Again, a sprinkle or two possible, but most of the action now well to our south. You see that line of showers moving across middle and south Georgia. Those yellow boxes, those are severe thunderstorm warnings. So we're still seeing severe weather across middle Georgia, and that's where we have an active tornado watch in effect. Again, a tornado watch means tornadoes are possible. This is not for anywhere in our viewing area. We are in the clear as far as any severe weather goes, but south and middle Georgia could still, see, could still see some tornadoes here as we head through the remainder of the evening. Right now, though, looking pretty good. No issues with any strong storms moving through the area. And the system that brought us those strong storms still bringing lots of rain across South Carolina and eastern Georgia. But that low will continue to push off to the east as it does. High pressure is going to move in from the northwest, and that's going to keep it nice and dry for the next several days. So no rain after we're done with tonight, and then we'll keep it dry. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, we don't have more rain in the forecast till the end of the weekend and early next week. Something else you'll notice, a big drop in temperatures. By the time you wake up tomorrow morning, we'll be in the low 40s, 43 in Atlanta, even some 30s across the North Georgia mountains as we drop down to 39 in Ella J. It's also going to be pretty windy. Winds tonight between 15 to 30 miles an hour. So do expect those winds to howl a bit tonight. Tomorrow morning when you wake up, we'll see 10 to 15 mile an hour winds before they start to die down through the afternoon. But tomorrow will be significantly cooler as well. We're not going to see those 70s and 80s. In fact, highs only getting up to 62 degrees tomorrow. Lots of sunshine, but it will be breezy. So tomorrow, if you've been wearing shorts and short sleeves and flip flops, put them away at least for one more day. We will warm back up. Not happening tomorrow, but by Thursday, we're back to the 70s and then we're back to the upper 70s as we head towards the weekend and early next week. So this little blast of cooler temperatures is very short lived. You're going to notice it mainly tonight and tomorrow night as we drop down to the low 40s. After that, it's back to springtime across Atlanta and North Georgia.